This one tech for see for one planting. And we have one in the shop for one crop growth. With no crit damage whatsoever.
Let's not take Chunky.
feel like the frequency would have been better, but I honestly don't know when it comes to this game. <clears throat> Can't be better. What am I known?
Nice. Definitely for you, see? Ever gotten a weird in Discord that are streaming? <clears throat> that is weird. I will look into that later. How are you, everyone? A consistent pattern of waking up in the PM. Those of you who were not aware because you didn't look at Twitter. My main channel had gotten another warning strike again, this time for hate speech. But the actual hate speech was not hate speech. It's there in the tweet, because I posted it in the server as well. Uh, but, um, I was talking the other day with, Us like, with um, Kessog, and I was describing the Nazbulgren, the Wojak with black eyes with rows of teeth that looks like Jeff the Killer. Unironically, they tried to give me a strike as though I had said that I, myself, did not like black people, despite this complexion. So it's clear to me that they are clearly gearing up the bots to deplatform multiple accounts during the election. There is no other reason. There is no other explanation. As I chase my alcohol with hot sauce. They clearly want people to be deplatformed by the bots. Because I posted the full context that it had cut off. There's no way. I'm going to go put the chicken in the, in the in not microwave, in the oven. But I first need to cut a hole in the bag so I can defrost the quarters despite the fact they've been out for at least two hours. Um, it's very clear with the full context. That I was not talking about denigration of the African American. But you know, stupidity.
Okay. Crash out chicken. Done. I'm good. Glad you're good. <sighs> I already know what league starters I intend on trying, so I don't even have to worry about that particular side of my build. I don't even know what's left. It's just count down to PoE, honestly. Some like monster hunter. It's money, I hate mommy. So I know it's all good. Everything in my neck of the woods is completely chill. The only thing that I'm waiting on is the end of the week so we can do the versus chat and then.
Your what? Croissants. One. We're French. Yes, you do. Croissant. 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 Slate odor. So he goes right next to Zur. Tail severable, face breakable. Really? I would have thought there would have been more hittable parts on you. Head breakable. Back breakable, ill severable. You are kind of hard. And the puckle. Just the head. What is that? A, is it a quest symbol? What else would you be hit by as a weak point here? Weird. chunk of the day. Make a drive out to see the fam for lunch. Cool. Okay. I complete with the doable. I was just wanted to know when exactly. Because if anything, before I move on to whatever next topic and start working on all the videos I have that are backlogged, I would at least want to be done with the Gamergate 2 shit by getting the rest of it out of the way. Unfortunately, harmful opinions have been has been on top of the subject matter while I've been distracted by life and business. Well, it's completely fine. What do you want from this? Really? 
I can upgrade them again. Okay. So it must have been the, all the skills from the Gigante for the next step up. It looks like this is the end of the upgrade tree. So it's whatever. Yeah. We're now at white viability. So that's not that hard to deal with. But I'm not making other weapons unless I feel like I want to. I need extra things in order to upgrade this. Honestly, based. Same here. So those are normal. Nurgle Crusher. I'm gonna have to make another one on the ore tree. Another one for the divergence on the Radabon tree, and the Oregon tree. Uh huh, uh huh, uh huh. Same with black steel. Jail hammer. Rathalos co coins? Huh? Coins? The weapons stats look fine. Coins? And of course, a step up here. Dragon King. Weakness exploit. Energy gun to hunter for max might. Okay, not bad. Recover your health as you can only attack monsters pretty good. As is the attack boost. There is Agitator. Agitator one, three, four. 
We'll get maximum maximum might, which isn't bad. But it clearly does fall off. This drops the agitator in place of props. That can also be okay if I want to customize it. So across this, you lose agitator, but you gain a two. You lose damage or surge, but you gain a two. You lose attack boost, but you gain a one. You lose Agitator, but you gain Stamina Surge plus a upgrade to 1 to 2 plus an additional 1. And you lose Attack Boost here, but you gain a 2. You only need 3 to activate the boost. So the question would be, which ones would you be taking? You'd have to at least get Jewels for... Roar, so you can mix and max with earplugs. Kieran does have divine blessing between the helm and the haif, but the rest of its parts are really bad. Dragon Queen, Dragon King is an okay eye patch <sighs> since it has weakness exploit. I just need to find an extra way to get it. As if I have to drop something for it, I'd rather it be a charm than dropping anything else. Because then I can get focus onto the armor through big pieces, but I just haven't gotten them yet. He has part breaker and he has handicraft along with latent power. Speed editing, Heartbreaker, Handicraft. Handicraft 1, 2, 3. We give you Weapon Sharpness 30. Hmm. Not exactly a fan of it. Any new charms? Yes. Maximum Mind and Agitator charms. Agitator is just obviously fine. Free damage for something that's going to happen through the entirety of a fight is fine. Maximum Might, however, is a little bit harder to use. I see. That's not bad. Earplugs is here. I think at some point during the week, I think it's either going to be Wednesday or Thursday. I think I'm going to do that live stream event that I talked about. Stream it only to Twitter. Mm. Should be fun. Post by right now.
beep, 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 beep. All right, everybody gather round. I'm gonna list the top. Top 50 bacterial infections. Oh, this cheery chick, honey. I'm out. Apparently somebody paid $4 to submit a prompt to uh, the AI-generated Family Guy livestream and basically halved the viewership permanently. Interesting. Like, it was presented with absolutely no context whatsofucking ever, but that's wild. Tex returns doing his, yeah, uh, already did his uh, excellent thing already. No, he's doing it right now. Okay, cool. Chloe's already talking to him on kick. That's cool. Choice. 
Say hi to your friends, punk. <laughs> Interesting. What is this from? Oh, I see. <coughs> what event? Um, I talked before about wanting to do a watch party for a couple of things that I either one, want to do for content, or two, wanted to watch for entertainment, but wanted to include the uh, sh the Discord or the audience for. I've been going around doing it as streams directly to Twitter. So, I've already done one, which was the basis of how I watched uh, uh, <laughs> the Marvels and Miss Marvel for the purposes of The Last Fried Chicanery. So whenever there's something I'm going to probably do for Fried Chicanery, I usually do it through a watch party. So that everybody can watch the same material that I'm watching. I even Did I even finish posting about that? Or did I just get, start getting sucked into the timeline? I probably got sucked into the timeline. Anything else someone can present to me that is a good comedy film. 2024 thus far yeah you told me before it doesn't work on mobile which is it's weird because I can see it on my mobile but I don't know what mobile it's not really working for I happen to have an Android I guess it doesn't work on iPhone or it just works haphazardly across the uh entirety of the thing. Ah. All these fucking quests, bro. All these fucking quests. I'm not going to be doing this one to do Nurgle, which is okay, because I'm going to probably be doing Nurgle for a while. Hunt a pink Kraytheon. Oh, this one's already completed. Okay. Azurathalos. I need to get used to capturing monsters and also killing them, so I'm going to start hunting my monsters without the intention of capturing them. All so that I can get more experience with Greatsword. Because once I'm more comfortable with using Greatsword back and forth, and really if I can get more uses of it on Nurgle, because Nurgle's the use case that I wanted to see, since all the clips that I got from that one video were from Nurgle, once I have fully grasped the Slinger combo.
Put your tail! I should not have done that like that, but I need to remember to turn that off. You turn so fast. In a mist. Painted because I did not dash before I used that. like that is where I dislike the fucking need of needing to use lines on Rathalos. Every single Wrath type always with that bullshit. It's so fucking annoying. To the point that it ran me out of fucking flashes. This example of being hit by poison when that attack shouldn't hit me at all because I'm on your face. Nice foot. And I'm stunned. And that would have been a knockout because of the stun. Ow. I'm 
Don't leave me in this corner, Mr. Bones. Fly too fast. And somehow that does not connect. How I dodged that is wild. Gotcha, bitch. <sighs> Literally never enough flashes. Literally never enough flashes. doesn't work for you you don't like how it looks it doesn't look all that different on uh, the stream side yeah <clears throat> it always looks a bit small like the window in which it takes in and what it looks like when it's streaming looks no different than a YouTube feed but the fact that it's there and it doesn't seem to be pushed by it seems weird but it's one of the few ways we have to get around the bullshit system about copyright, because ain't nobody on Twitter trying to really worry about copyright that way. It gives for an opportunity for people to watch it in a way. It gives us a place to do it, and like, we can pull the feed later for editing purposes. It's a whole thing.
Where is my towel? Must be in here somewhere. It's probably in the corner. Yes, it is. That's my towel in the corner. It's monogrammed with my three main most used initials. It was made by my neighbors. It's <sighs> literally the only piece of clothing and or possession that I have that has my initials monogrammed into them. I feel like a big box when I lose it. I feel like all those live, laugh, love moms. Womp womp. Womp 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 womp. Womp womp. Womp 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 womp. Womp womp. To the trade yard. Between each mission, I should put in the ancients and then just keep upping them with soft soil. That was the wrong one. I'm supposed to put in the mushroom one. Fuck me. Fuck me in the ass. What did you get me? Toxin Sack, Rathians, Eroth, Therioth, Diabolos, Poison Sack. Raytheon. A couple of random Raytheon pieces, but you know. Eedy woody. Eedy woody. I'm gonna keep requesting uh, material pieces just to upkeep my stack and my storage. It's better for me to sort them like this. Okay, the other one hasn't returned yet. Got plenty of quests to do now. All the time in the world to get used to uh, doing the thing. HR Odegaran. Uragon is probably going to be a little bit harder. Rathalos, same. At least it's not the yeah, Azura Rathalos, but I still need to practice my Wrath type kills. Because all of these are going to be fucked with until I have uh, flies again. Which means I'm my own expedition. It's probably going to be an expedition to... Uh, where was the highest amount that I got my flies from? I think it was from the Coral Highlands. I suppose it should be easy because I should be able to do that fine. I'm gonna put my foot in a bud. Put my foot in a bud. Put my foot in a bud. In their bud. Put in their bud. I think I'm always just gonna take Chef's Choice. I'd rather have an increase of full health and full stamina as high as I can get it and having it in any small variety. <clears throat> Please, I'm begging you, give me the goddamn easy supply flash. 
I'm begging. I'm begging. I'm begging. Schlagging. Schlagging. Now, with great sword opens, since the stone can be used to go into true slash, I have to make sure that I can always find another pair. To immediately attach it to. It'd be great if the charge slash would cause a wound. <laughs> that should not be that easy. Play shit. That's gonna be a run. You're not gonna let me cut this, are you? Thank you for being nice. That is not where I wanted that. That failed. No faints. And also proper usage of flash during that. 
Because if there's one thing that I haven't actually been able to master, it's the use of using flash pods as the interrupt of a singer. Sometimes it's just better to do it when they're right in front of your face, but you, then you forget to take it off because you have to deselect it. Fastest way to deselect it is to use whatever bomb or whatever material happens to connect to the ground. That worked about better than it should have. In my opinion. Stop wrestling! Goodbye. <laughs>
Let's not break my cell phone, Carl. No dents, no scratches, we're good. Negroes, 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 Negroes. Bum, ba dum, ba dum. Ding, 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 ding. Little Negroes, 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 Negroes. Ding, 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 ding. Do it used to be something good. Scent hound, blast resistance. These are not something I consider good. <clears throat> We, we, Irigon's turn. We. And somehow that worked. I wouldn't imagine that hits. No, it's not.
Oh, I'm not gonna finish cutting this. Oh, somehow that did not hit me as fast as I thought it would. And I'm in stun. <coughs> <coughs> <laughs> that's not fair. And that's done. Unfortunately, interrupts the sun with the shaking. done. Got your itch. Good run, Carl. I shouldn't have needed to use so many max pills, but good run, Carl. Yeah, that combo is extremely important. Being able to immediately skip over the middle section and not need to run through the other skills but immediately go there makes the stone even more powerful in the hands of Greatsword. The Slinger combo is... I, I, can't, I can't imagine not using it if it's that available and it's that good. Because the unfortunate fact is that this is Thorn Pods. What the fuck am I finna do with Thorn Pods? On Great Sword! The sheer density makes it so great. 
Hey, Carl, would you like to see an LTG for me? Yeah, just post it in the server, and I'll look at it. Where y'all even at? If you post it in the server, I'm looking at it. Lots of hard bone. Another scale of John the Scoot. I know I got a um, fancy word for fucking cerebral webbing. It's gonna be wild to be able to get things off of, off of him. I'm not even sure that Hammer hits him and beats him down faster. It sure feels like it. Just simply based on movement alone. I guess you can only have up to four effects. Next one. Go to Garen. You should actually be much easier. Since I can cut his tail, it'll actually take away a lot of his range. The lies of a fire. I missed.
fully miss. This. And out. I'm not that shot by that one. I landed a lot of good trues there. And I barely got the tail off by the end. He is not a very good candidate to tackle attacks into. Because he's extremely erratic. Nice play. He's extremely erratic. A lot of his moves, he wants to constantly dash and dive. So it's impossible to know when to actually tackle for them. Unless you can see the claw swipe coming. You don't trust it to slow or put the mind up. Cooking. Two tails. Okay. Three tails. Okay. 
and legs, head, or limbs.
My wife's gonna get on me. She is going to rip me apart when she gets her hands on me. But that's a problem for Carl a week later from now to do. Carl a week prior to then, his job is to make her angry. Uh, 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 what is this all? Growth speed. Burn. Wrong guy. No, this is all of them. Soft soil just extends the effect of current fertilizer. That's what it does. I'm dumb. Okay, so this is the maximum. This is the maximum. Uh, Safari's returned. I could target you while I go get Fushim. Can this buy potions also? Yeah. to worry less about whole drinks like just make into that pile go to Syria's or the re-up on trap tools I'm about around 500 but however I bother to get it to just to be safe for cuttings Quick browse through the workshop to make sure I'm up on hammers.
Uh, yeah. I was in the kitchen. What's good, in word? I'm sorry, did she bite you under the desk, or...? No. Okay. Also, this just in. You, you remember that stream ago when I was talking to oh. Kesog out on camera, trying to describe the Nazbul grin? And I tried to describe it as when people really, really, really use a meme to try and describe racists with, and I used, and I can't repeat the phrase again, because it'll get shrinken again, but I insert word here, black people, but I'm describing the meme itself. Yeah, apparently that's against uh, YouTube TOS. And the wild part is, is that it zoomed in, the bot zoomed it in to that particular part of the statement, but the tweet's up on my timeline, and I also posted it in the server. The bots are being programmed to try and go haywire for the election cycle. So that's great. Tried to appeal it, they instantly denied it. So I had to take the policy course, and their policy apl applications are, um... Barring the word that starts with R. Mentally interesting. <laughs> Besides that, um, I've just been playing Monster Hunter World. Going back and forth between the kitchen, when I go to the kitchen I make a TikTok. Because my wife is using TikTok again, which means I am teasing her over the internet. Fair enough. I am doing Iceborne content Fuck. right now. Okay. And I fucking hate fighting the, this... Because I forgot that they have variant types in, in Iceborne. And the variant types are really fucking annoying. Uh... I mean, I find that your wrestlers are annoying, but that's because the wrath types, with the exception of the Wraithians, like to stay in the air forever. Fair enough. Uh, like, for for example, Viper Toby Kada uh, Kadachi. So it's poison instead of lightning, which would be diff. Uh, it has special moves. It, it's moves that, instead of, like, lightning and sh shit, it's it's poison, but uh -huh. it has poison fucking needles. Uh huh. I got so hard. I got so hard experience it's... first. Yeah, but I bet he's cute as fuck though. Oh, how are you doing, Jack? What's up? How are you really? Uh, good. Okay. Playing Call of Duty, suffering with no aim assist. I'm out. I need to eat a steak. No. Other than that, I'm watching Sage. The hunter uh, is... Work on her cosplays. Okay. On Wednesday and Thursday, I'm probably going to do live stream events on Twitter. We're going to probably watch Quiet on Set and Mia Culpa. Jay's tagging along. I think she should be able to speed through all of them. I don't know. Besides that, I don't really have much to present and or talk about. People have been asked people have been asking me amongst my IRL friends as I started posting the videos from his birthday, saying, in this order, Bro, I didn't know you had a wife. Oh my god, you have a baby, he's so cute. I didn't know you have a wife. Oh my god, the baby, he looks so I didn't know you have a While I appreciate them being happy on my behalf. I don't know. Part of me wants to choke them to death. Is that weird? Because oh, you've told so many people so many times it gets often repetitive. No, it's more like I'm standing there and I'm being rewarded for an achievement. But the achievement is so brain dead easy. Yeah. Like I was present in my child's birthday. I don't know why that it makes me angry when other people celebrate it like it's about. No, no, I do know actually. Uh. On top of the I'm fact- I'm getting really pissed off as this fucking poison, good god. That's why I care, herbal remedies and antidotes. But, um, in terms of 
why it makes me angry. I know why it does. I dislike the fact that it does because this is usually one of those things where people are like, oh my god, your wife is pregnant, congratulations, and they just walk up to a dude and they start patting him on the balls like, you did a good job, you did a good job. But in this case, I'm not even the biological father, but at the same time, they're flabbergasted by the fact that not only did a woman want me, but in their mind, because I just stopped correcting them at this point, I used to tell her that I was going to say, I'm not the father, as like a humorous point, but now I'm getting a lot more pleasure by just standing there and sniggering. I hope that doesn't strike the fucking copy strike. <laughs> if it does, that's some bullshit. <laughs> he, said, he, said, he said a word with the N word in it. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, no, Toby has some ridiculously long-range attacks. What the fuck is this variant? I'm imagining it must be a tail whip. It's a tail whip that throws darts towards you. Block? I mean, maybe... I'm longsword. Period. Use a lot of clutch attacks and avoid being hit. I, I can't. I don't even have time to fucking like, antidote. Rip. This is the issue with fast enemies, but it's also really fucking cool sometimes to handle fast enemies. And then you get handled. Yeah. Yeah. And also, I'm now finally realizing I have to roll towards that that certain attack where it's in the fucking air. Mm. It would be like. Yeah, I get fucked. I it do be like that. Also, I realize that this longsword is not the greatest thing to fight uh, normal type with. Because it's meant to handle elders. Mm. Are you using are you using the Nergi the Nergi one? Yeah, the Nergi one. I mean, it's, I mean, it's not bad. It's, it's not bad. Just... It's specifically meant to fucking kill the, them. I'm but... be, I'm gonna be a hundred percent honest with you, Marcus. Hmm? Rathian longsword is definitely a better better approach. Probably. I mean, are you talking about the Rathian tree ones? Yeah. Yeah. Fair enough. Mostly just because it uh. You still get the crit bonus as well as still having the um Yeah, you still get the crit bonus as well as having the uh poison tick on it. Alright. Which in my opinion is always a win win. It depends on the application and what the enemy type is. General poison is fine. I have not experienced taking it into somebody else's expeditions or their raid missions if I choose to answer an SOS. Because there's all. Literally last night, that one longsword guy killed Nurgle before I got fucking down, and I had literally 30 seconds to run back to that. 30 seconds spared when I made it back to the corpse to get my carbs in. Granted, he did say sorry, he didn't mean to overkill it. But at the same time, imagine that scenario, but you have to go all the way back to the nearest base camp. You're definitely not making it back to the corpse in time. And it's because nobody wanted to pull the agar off so that you could do it. And that was with yeah. me using great sword, so I could block. I got put in the corner for 15 seconds, and I blocked from white to green. And then I tried to move to heal, didn't trust my instincts to heal, and got downed for it. Now imagine I put all the investment into the combat, and they just killed it, and I don't get a single fucking carve, not even the tail. I would be pissed. <clears throat> That's what it feels like poison would do. But with the interaction with the poison plants inside the ancient forest, I don't really know how to feel about poison, to be honest. It doesn't look like it'd be a downturn. It just looks and feels like it would be. But it's not. Yeah. 
Oh fuck, I can't make herbal medicine. God damn it. Uh, That's okay. I don't remember what you need for herbal medicine, but I think you can find some of them on the fly, but you probably are Blue not mushrooms. In, yeah, you're probably not in an area where you can put them all together. Literally everywhere is snow. Unfortunately. A mouse. Might be bell. Oh well, it's okay. I can manage. I mean, I could take out the bow gun and just start shooting the fuck out of the Toby, but I like long sword, so I'm gonna stick with it. Like, a part of me likes long sword and melee weapons, but sometimes I just really want to fucking just shoot a motherfucker. Does that make sense? Sometimes. Uh... You have to remember, I literally only learned how to use bow because I was tired of the melee technique to attack the noise so that I can farm screamer pods. I learned how to play melee so I can okay. learn the move sets. If I remember correctly, statistically speaking, poison ends up giving you around maybe an additional 520 damage from taking, and then it can be reapplied again right the moment it ends. Also, also I think it does do its paralysis its deal. That's cool. And you just got sleep, bitch. Unfortunately, I didn't bring any bombs with me, so... Fuck it! I have to get back into bomb usage. His tip was out of the way. Now Uragon's hovering over my head. Poison plant right next to us. That's cool. That's a lot of slingers I, I'd love to use if I could get to them. Whose genius idea was it to give Uragon fucking bombs in this game? I'm already traumatized from Basil. Uh, I mean, he's always he's had it since, like, three. I don't recall the bombs, but then again, it was a while since I had played 3. I'm used... if... if it was... I don't remember how they worked in 3. I could have swore he just threw them out and they exploded immediately, instead of the Basil Goose pod type, um... of explosion. I don't know. It's it's been a, it's been a while for me too, but I'm. I feel like he did still throw. I feel like he still did have the ball in three, like that. Of course, I fucking missed the last hit. Fuck! I hate helm stacking helm splitters. So fucking annoying. Are you in a mission with another hunter? Nope. Also, think, because of the net code of this fucking game, sometimes it just fucks with me. What do you mean by stacking helm splitters? Are you trying to chain helm splitter back to back? What I'm trying to do is I'm trying to get the. I'm trying to not do. Like, just go white and then just re reapply. So I go white to yellow to red and start putting helm splitter charges up. That still sounds like you're trying to chain helm splitter. 
No, I just don't want to fucking use a multitude of fucking. God damn it. I just don't want to use like. I just don't want to do like all of the just recharge, recharge, recharge bullshit. I see. Um, have you been making use of jumping into Spirit Three? Mm, I don't have ledges around me. No, no, no! Jump, jumping into Spirit Three is right. Like, is fading slash into Rising Three. Jumping immediately skips Spirit Two into Spirit Three. Fair enough. So if you're doing anything like opening slash fade draw, or you're using stab into fading into jumping into Spirit Three. You should be able to land your combos easily to immediately start your charges. Then once you hit the charge phase, it's just a question of putting off the combo, whether you start it with Spirit Thrust into Helm Splitter, and then using Jumping 3 to reset from each phase to have your highest uptime. He followed me! Gotcha, bitch! Can you all turf war, please? Gotcha. Oh, okay. When it hits, it hits. Take a shower. Gotcha. No, 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 no! Don't leave the area, please. I'm begging you. Let me kill you! You bitch! Hello, Double Drill. I hate when fucking other mon- I- mm, These are the situations where I scream at myself for not bringing bomb pods and also bringing gun pods. Herbal blood. <laughs> Dude, I have to bring like so many herbal medicines. Jesus Christ. I always bring a full stack of herbal and antidote. I don't always need them on most missions, but I'd rather have them in the situations where I somehow regrettably get hit by poison. It's very bad for inventory space. But I'd rather have it than not need it than need it and not have it. Because I can always, when between re ups, if I'm going back to the camp, replace it. In the inventory. That does not feel like that should have done an immediate kill cut. But okay, I'll take it. Okay. Mega Demon Potion. I think the one monster I still struggle with is Ball. Ball Hazak? Yes. Just, just because using a Grey Sword, I'm, I stand next to him the entire time. So uh, by the time I'm finished doing my combo, he's already got his, um, effluvium shit on me. That somehow knocked me out of the air. I didn't know that screams could knock you out of the air, but alright, that's Yes, cool. they can. It's the that's, reason... Yes, it's very that's annoying. So, it's very that's, annoying. That's so fucking stupid. It can knock you out of the air, it can knock you out of clutches. It is the reason I immediately put on Earplug 5. I did not want to deal with this while learning the monster openings. Some weapons and some tools that have invincibility frames to get past roars that are not Elder Roars, like the tackle mechanic that I learned from that video I watched before, yesterday. It helps, but it's also one of those, if you can't do this well, you should have this kind of thing. Okay. I don't think I've ever had to run earplugs. I technically don't have to run them, I just prefer running them. Because I like having the DPS time to not lose my openings. But that's also probably because when I dodge, I've, I've, I'm so used to roar timings that I just dodge, in, I dodge into it into wide slash to get into strong slash. I don't often get the timing on it, I feel. I'd rather go the approach of just 
doing it immediately. And the pickle's here. Why is the pickle here? Oh, I've got a faint. But that also might be because I have the uh, skill that increases my dodge in both frames rather than extend the distance I go. I don't think the game has given me that as an unlock yet. Also, is there a tier higher than Mega Potion? Uh, no. no. Understand. Oh, the T Toby T Kadachi Hard Claw. Thank you. Somehow actually. Uh, evade window. Evade window is what it's called, I believe. That's the skill. That's a miss. Why do they always move so far when they get hit by a slagger? They just fly halfway across the fucking battle arena. Like, bro, I hit you hard. I ain't hit you that hard. That's fine. I really wish that the tackle mechanic actually just tanked the damage that you hit instead of just allowing you to go through the flinching of it. I guess that'd be too strong, but at the same time, I, uh, I'm tired of taking 50% of my life, making an opening for me to then attack off of. And my dumbass has the fucking non-trap set up. It's getting really low, it seems. Okay, at least I took armor. At least I took that armor and it made me feel a lot stronger. I'm gonna play the Binding of Isaac, see if I can actually do a greed run with, yeah, do a greed run with uh, Azazel. A version. Just holy pendants. shit. Huh? Yeah, pendants. I've gotten to Ultra Greed, but Ultra Greed's so goddamn dangly. Oh my god, Wolgs, if you do. So there's an enemy. Uh, there's like this thing called a Volg in Iceborne, and it just latches on to you because it fucking hates your life. Man, what does it do when it latches on to you? Drain your stats? It just lat latches on to you and is a massive fucking hindrance. Okay. That's all it does. It just latches on to you because it, it's a fucking honey badger and it doesn't give a fuck. I see. Pickle. <laughs> What was my quest requirement? Right. Uragon and Pisces. Okay, Pickle. 
You got me for 15 minutes of beating your ass. I'm actually running out of, running out of fucking antidotes. We might want to look into poison resistance for this monster hunt then. Nullberry doesn't fucking work, unfortunately. Wish it did. For poison? No. I wish. That would be so much easier, because I have Nullberry. It would also be very broken. Yes. Because it, it deals with most ailments, anyways. Yeah, but most ailments in the game are blights. Mm -hmm. Also does help the fact that the weapons that... I feel like you're supposed to have for <clears throat> are, are supposed to be a lot stronger. <sighs> Luckily, it's an expedition. Ouch. That's at least a saving grace. Devil Joe's tail is severable, yes? Yes. I believe so. Part of me wants to grab my, my dual blades and just fucking tango with it. If you feel that's your best technique. Because if I can... I... I like speed and or I like range. I need either speed or range. Longsword is not doing that enough. Speed or range? Speed or range, yeah. So I can ha I can probably get I could get both potentially, but it's just a fucking headache. I mean, Glade kinda... Glade kinda has a speed. Yeah, I like Glaive. But... I'm not sure if I can handle... all of that in practice. The weapons are weapon types. They're not necessarily tools to counter an enemy. It, it, the weapons are as well as you play them. Correct. You're just a little bit inexperienced with the longsword, that's fine. At least that's on using a Toby. That specific Toby. But go ahead, longsword is... Longsword is... Once you get the rhythm of longsword, it becomes pretty much a bread and butter weapon. Rather than looking at it as a twin blade, where you want to do it as much damage as possible in demon mode, you need to think of it more like a rhythm weapon. Which is ironic, because Hunting Horn is technically the rhythm weapon, but the rhythm of your attacks need to be timed with your spirit blade upgrades, like an install. But the install rhythm of your combat is based on what the enemy is currently doing, the same way with the greatsword. Greatsword is a hit-and-run playstyle. I'm not usually a hit-and-run kind of person, in the sense of hit-and-run and find an opening and keep attacking through said opening. I am much more... I was on top... Okay, whatever. Whatever, Devil Joe. Okay, whatever. I don't really play the Greatsword to hit-and-run, though. I don't. But I've been looking at some of the guides that have been helping with it, and one of the guides that instrumented the idea of using the tackle as a way to make your openings is you will move around and look for an opening and if they begin to attack you during that opening you can use the tackle as a disrupt you'll tank the damage that will come from the dps of what you're doing but your ability to um 
apply your damage will then be using that new opportunity window that was created from the damage of what you're using. So, using the tackle in the middle of, say, Devil Joe's tailspin, that will actually interrupt him long enough to give me an opening to cut his tail like I am right now, in combination with my palico traps. Because he keeps moving his fucking ass too much. Whereas with Longsword, if he is doing something that doesn't give me a necessarily long opening, I'm going to time my spirit usage with EI situations. Because EI is your doorway to having meter without having charged meter. Because the only thing that Spirit Sheath actually does is it sets up for a type of draw attack, which is a bar burner, in the terms of your charge meter. Whereas EI Slash is used not only as an extender, but it can also be used as a reposition tool, as well as a way to start charging. I also did just pick the grab my Bowgun, because I don't know why, Light Bowgun just kind of feels very nice to me, just because I can, I select which ammo I want, and I just go from there. God, I, there's one weapon I'm never going to use again, just because I, the playstyle of it for me ended up becoming just a power crushing weapon. But then again, I was hunting Nergis in under, I think, 45 seconds per hunt. Just to farm up for a certain uh, his jewel. What the hell? Oh, bam borrow. The dickhead of monsters. Finally. Yeah, he he's a fucking cunt. Holy shit, he's fucking up the Toby. <laughs> Good. Who's fucking up the Toby? Bambaro. Bonnie. Bombi. I call him Bombi. I also just realized I accidentally came into this... Came into this thinking that like, ah yes, let me just not... get anything. What was that? Alright, now the Bambaro is be being a shithead. Oh yeah. You can enemies range, I wanna cut your tail. Perfect. That was a gem. Oh nice. Thank you, sir. Now get on your knees. I'm not done with you yet. I can't tell if this Bambaro is trying to attack me or attack the Toby. This is like so weird. Mambaro, do not discriminate. Catch these horns, I guess. Fuck. Not a good. Not a good run. Time, I know that you love to go the fucking you piece of shit. Yep, that's what you get. That's what you fucking get. Want to play these games again? Yep, yep. Keep running into my traps, bitch. Marcus, have you considered the idea of a switch axe? Potentially. I actually have looked into it slightly, but why? I don't know, I, 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 I've always enjoyed Switch Axe. 
I think Marcus would like Switch Axe. To your nest. Still don't see the skulls yet. I don't want to capture this Toby. I don't, I don't think I'll ever use heavy bow gun though. Mm -mm. Thing to the king. And clean your face, and also your face, and trap my hango. Captured. <sighs> Suspended boulders. Large boulders that could fall in an instant. You should see to drop them on unsuspecting targets. Where are these boulders? Ah, that's the lagmite formation, and that's the lagmite formation. I see. That's a little confusing because that doesn't have any kind of indication that told me that I could have dropped that on their heads. Does Mega Demon Drug buff your gun? Uh, it should it buff buffs your... your raw attack. Yeah, it buffs your attack value. Okay, good. Now, where is the guy? He should be in the lava area. Seems I need a mushroom. It's the big, big bang. The reason I'm alive. Because one thing that I've learned with a bunch of the weapons is how Slinger Bursts introduce new varying ways for them to be used. Um, I'm still learning the Longsword one, only because I have not been using a Longsword this week. But between the hammer... The hammer and its ability to use its charge attacks as a staggering effect to set up either a level 2 or a level 3 directly to an enemy's face. Since most of the time you're holding your charge to begin with anyways, is a very significant damage boost. Not only because you have the combination of using the slinger in the sort of put this in your mouth situation, but it's more the up close and personal staggering effect combos with uh, the staggering KO power. Where you can go from a stagger into a knockout back into a stagger into a knockout because of the effect of the slingers that are being dropped by the monsters you're hunting. But for the greatsword, the great the um greatsword has a condition of its slingers where after the use of any slinger with anything that could throw out the attack. It skips the combo directly to the true damage, to the uh, the true power charge. So you could be opening up from draw with a overhead draw attack, immediately slinger. That slinger could be a bomb. The bomb goes off, and then whether you hold it or not, that true will go through and will give you the payout that you need for the damage to stagger the monster and possibly cut off the tail or put them in a knockdown state. I have done this consistently five times in a row now against monsters with severable tails. I cannot tell if it's the raw damage of the Defender 5, since I've now fought Nargle to upgrade them to Defender 5, or if it's just that much power immediately going into the tail sever where normal weapons would still need to have the setup to get the weapon talking, off in time. Are you talking about the greatsword? Yes. It's just because it's just because greatsword has so much raw damage on it that it it's pretty much the go-to weapon for heart breaking. Yes. Because it could still break horns too. Yes. Just because of how hard it hits. Because that is also being applied across the weapon when it comes to its um to its ability to stagger. The tackle has knockout effect on it, but it also has the ability to interrupt. You still do take the damage, like I mentioned earlier, 
But these situations where I'm immediately knocking it down, then setting up with wound or without wound, and still hurting it, is kind of throwing me off, honestly. Because usually my problem with hammer is that I can't tell how much damage the hammer's actually doing. Can you get out the water, Lava Sloth? But on the other hand, the confusing part with the great sword damage is that things that I don't expect to hit are hitting, and things that I don't expect to cut are cutting. That and I'm using a combination of weakness exploit as well. So getting the wounds on, and then getting off higher level affinity hits that are uh, comboing, is um, jarring, to say the least. Yeah, Great Sword's kind of just your big hit stick that you really just want to run with. If you feel like a monster's giving you too much trouble and you need to hit it really hard. This is a shotgun, Toby. I was gonna say, like, you'll almost never see me dodging with the great sword. I will shoulder tackle through all of them, all the attacks, if I have the chance. One thing that I miss, however, from the hammer is the built in mind's eye. Because I tried multiple times to go for a tail cut, and I'm bouncing off the lava sea off, not sloth, sea offs, lake plate. I'm trying to angle it so I can cut him, but just keep bouncing off his leg. Viper Toby will leave the locale soon. Seriously? It always feels like those messages come up at the worst opportune moment. Yeah, they kind of do. Because basically, now I have to basically all in it. Which is fucking annoying as shit. I wouldn't say all in. Dump you just have to make it stagger. Which is very hard to do sometimes. I have a bow gun. Uh, you got red ammo? Yep. Okay, red ammo. The, there's the answer. Oh, I got 10 minutes to 10, 10 minutes. At least he's finally leaving this area. Can you, can you turf war him? Turf war him. Come on, do a turf war. Come on, do a boogaloo! Yeah! Hey, boom over here. We. Okay, fuck you. I'm getting sick and tired of your fucking bullshit. You're, you're fucking limping, and then you're fucking behaving like this? No, fuck off. Equip this. That's a solid connection.
you get off the lava, sir. Oh, what is that? Was running into that? It is awkward. And he's digging again. Oh, the Dodama is stuck inside the fire geyser. Oh yeah, that's right. I need to make a Dodogama. I need to make a Dodogama. Uh, uh, hunting horn. I feel like the spread ammo is not doing a whole lot. Unfortunately, the gun I'm using can't use slicing ammo, which sucks. Or am I retarded? Lava CS tail isn't cuttable, is it? Isn't it considered a Piscine? It's not. Okay, I'm yeah, retarded. No, we can't. Good job, Carl. You don't know your monsters. I should have been beating your ass like you were a Jerotaros! And just hitting that fucking head. Because God forbid, uh, I've seen wyverns have any kind of stun resistance. Just limping now, huh? We're just limping now. I got something for the EP. I got something for your EP, mister. Yeah, how about that for some EP? Yep, I killed it. Let's mess Thank with fucking EP. god. I, I wish I could, I wish I could have, like, captured it, but eh, it's whatever. <sighs> fucking hell, that was annoying. I think for your mental, it was important that you killed it rather than capture it. Whoa. Wait, my mental? Yes, you mentally need the satisfaction of seeing it dead, rather than capturing it. Yeah, maybe. Wow. I just, it was just like, getting really, that, because it was just like, okay, let me get this straight. So, I can dance around this thing back to back to back to back to back, but each and every single time, it's throwing fucking poison darts at me. And these poison darts, will are just fucking extremely long range. It has an AOE attack version of it. We're just fucking Beyblades, it's fucking bullshit. Yeah. It's like fucking ridiculous. I have numbers between 169 and one number between 116. 1, 5, 25, 45, 17, 15. I probably need to do is probably look for better options for all of them. I don't know. Got an Ergon Ruby, two mysterious face stones, an advanced uh, armor spear, more hard bones, one infernal sack, no sacks amongst the double joes. With talon scales and tail fangs. And talons. And scoot. From the Aragon face. Feels like a jit. Survival expert botanist. I never get any good appraisal stones, oh my god! At least I'm walking away with 50k because I use a double time voucher. Now check my chicken jet! Try not to scream the hard R while I'm out of the room.
No, I'm joking. Need that run? Well, I fuck on this cunt. How many harlots did you say? <laughs> okay, please let this need a run. I have maxed out damage, maxed out tears, just to do this fucking fight. Uh, Dex just AFK. He didn't say he was gonna take a shower. Oh, yeah, he did. In fact, he said not to say it should only make you want to say it more. Drop the tackle and bomb. Listen, listen, well, then not Callum, okay? You just drop it, Cal. The sense of mind to remember that that word isn't accepted in the West like it is in the British Isles. And of course, in the scholastic sense. Yeah, no, that word. I, I used scholar in a scholar aspect to refer to a condition of that and basically told me you can't say that word you need to change this and I'm like I'm using the medical like yeah track. you told you told like, me this I'm before actually using yeah. a medical term what are you doing <clears throat> and she was like yeah yeah yeah, she she was she was like just upset. It was like this is not appropriate for the class. And it's like, the hell do you mean? It's like, oh, that's so cool. You basically just told me straight up, like, nah, nah, you can't you can't actually use proper like ver like terms and whatnot to signify and elaborate on all of this shit that you're explaining. You have to go, you have to do like this fucking weird around. I do not believe that we should live in a society where people are terrified of accurate descriptions of words. I don't speak leftist, I speak English and Creole. Involves an extended amount of leftism. Apparently, I'm scarred my wife's co worker and her jaw hit the floor. What was her reaction? Lol. Okay, stop playing Monster Hunter for now. That fight took. Now I'm just laughing at the fact that apparently she showed her co her, her co-worker how I'm taunting her on TikTok. <laughs> that just makes me look forward to it more, sweetheart. I'm sorry. <laughs> oh, you are lagging really badly, girl. Yeah, probably am now. Did spike? Pretty much. I don't know what caused it. What? I like how... Weird. I like how fucking Warframe... Because I still get news about Warframe, and I look into it from time to time, just to see, like, you know what, let, let, let's... What are they doing? What are they doing? What, what is the game that I said fuck you to 
doing. And so far, it has been just a whole lot of just bullshit going back to the past. Because you need to apparently go back to the past. To 1999. Hmm. Yay. 